New York State Police have blocked off a good portion of Silver Lake Road as they investigate this shooting. Now, what we know so far is that one victim has been taken to the hospital while one person is now in police custody. New York State Police have yet to inform us of who exactly those people are. Now, I talked to first responders who were here earlier this morning, and they told me that one man shot a woman and that this is now considered a death investigation. But New York State Police have yet to confirm that. The El Sable Valley School District was locked down temporarily this morning, but since has been lifted. I was also told from first responders that the shooting happened outside and that police are interviewing neighborhood houses that may have saw the shooting occur. Well, right now we're continuing to gather the latest information that we can and we'll bring it to you at 5 and 6. Reporting in El Sable Forks, Josh Mitchell, NBC5 News. And we want to remind you right now, Silver Lake Road is closed down to Dry Bridge Road. Again, New York State Police tell us a suspect is in custody. They say the public isn't in any danger. We know the lockdown has been lifted at nearby schools.